Reed streaked toward me. Ah, it's gonna hurt me. A crimson paper heart, cut from the best construction paper I could buy at Dollar General, soared toward my baby sister. She shielded her face. Stop it! It's not gonna hurt you, I said. Reed clutched the burgundy curls that cascaded over her shoulders. Then why is it chasing me? The heart flapped its body like wings, wobbling through the air. The thing wasn't exactly aerodynamic, though it was, in fact, aiming right toward Reed. I cocked my head. She had a point. It might want to cut her. My name is Dylan Appel, and I'm a witch. My whole family is. Well, all of them except Reed, who was currently under attack from a decoration for the annual Silver Springs Valentine's Day dance. Yep, it was a community affair, come one, come all, from the geriatrics to the littlest ones. But this particular paper heart, limply beating its body around the room, was supposed to be hanging from the ceiling of the high school gymnasium, not magically bobbing around it. Therein lay the problem. My maternal grandmother, Hazel Horton, pushed up the sleeves of her sequined Valentine's sweater. The front had a naked Cupid shooting an arrow. The back had the phrase, will you be mine? She hadn't gotten a lot of offers on the ladder yet. Grandma grabbed me by the shoulders. Dylan, you must wrangle them. Get control of the hearts before they shred our skin. I stopped. Me? Why me? My other sister, Serafina, Sarah for short, punched a heart to the floor and smashed it with her boot. Because you're the one who caused this. They're supposed to be on the ceiling, not attacking us. That was indeed true. I might be a witch, but I'm not always great at magic. I'm getting better, but it takes a while to learn all the ins and outs of witchcraft. Apparently, right now was one of those out times. <laughs>